We learn more each day about the coronavirus. The symptoms are similar to pneumonia, but we now know patients can lose their sense of taste or smell. And there are reports of patients with lesions on their feet or swollen toes. Here's our chief medical correspondent, Dr. John LaPook, on another dangerous symptom, blood clots. So far, the one predictable thing about the new coronavirus is that it's unpredictable. It first got our attention by damaging the lungs. But now, doctors are finding it can wreak havoc throughout the body. One way is by causing blood clots, for example, in the legs. And that clot then travels from the leg to the lungs, which can create even further problems. And that adds insult to the injury already caused by the virus, says cardiologist Dr. Samin Sharma of New York's Mount Sinai Hospital. The abnormal clotting can be widespread. Clotting in the heart, clotting in the lungs, clotting in the kidneys, clotting in the brain arteries. Those clots can damage the kidneys, leading to dialysis, the brain causing confusion, seizures or strokes, and the heart causing an irregular rhythm or a heart attack. You've been doing this for about 30 years. Are you feeling like a medical student again? Well, in some ways, yes. This is a new frontier, right? That is a, absolutely a new frontier. I don't even know what will be the other atypical and unusual presentation of COVID-19. And that's presenting doctors with a tough challenge, trying to figure out the different ways this virus can attack our bodies and the various symptoms it can cause when we seem to be learning new things about it every day. Dr. John LaPook, CBS News.